Introduction Have you ever found yourself entangled in thoughts of your twin flame, pondering how to progress forward? Transitioning from a twin flame relationship can prove to be a formidable journey, often laden with profound emotions and transformative encounters. Whether faced with the separation of twin flames or endeavoring to decipher the indications of a false twin flame, the path to recovery and evolution necessitates recognition and resolution of these distinct challenges. Key takeaways. Embracing self-love. Unveiling the significance of self-affection as a pivotal stride in advancing. Understanding the twin flame connection. Acknowledging the profound spiritual and emotional connection that characterizes twin flame unions. Navigating separation and reunion. Mastering the ability to handle the peaks and valleys of twin flame odysseys, encompassing separation and perspective reconciliation. Identifying signs and stages. Discerning the manifold signs and phases of a twin flame relationship, encompassing the roles of the pursuer and the pursued and the intricacies of the bond, healing and personal growth, prioritizing personal evolution and convalescence as fundamental elements of moving on from a twin flame encounter. Twin flame moving on, strategies for healing and evolving from your experience. The process of moving on from a twin flame entails an introspective expedition of self-revelation and recuperation. It extends beyond mere detachment from an individual, encompassing the embracement of a fresh chapter, replete with self-adoration and personal maturation. Complex relationship scenarios. Scenario description. Conclusion of a twin flame relationship The emotional and spiritual journey following the termination of a twin flame union. Realization of false twin flame identifying and transcending a relationship that masqueraded as a twin flame connection. Healing following separation The convalescent voyage post twin flame parting focuses on individual growth. Challenges of twin flame reunion grasping the complexities and emotional upheavals of a twin flame reuniting. Dynamic of pursuer and pursued understanding and navigating the roles of the pursuer and the pursued in a twin flame voyage. Post twin flame spiritual awakening the personal evolution and spiritual enlightenment, ensuing the departure from a twin flame. Self-love and letting go of twin flame embracing self-adoration as a linchpin in moving forward from a twin flame entanglement. Life beyond twin flame constructing a gratifying existence after a twin flame experience, emphasizing personal aspirations and relationships. Circumstances of twin flame moving on. Abrupt termination of connection. Coping with the sudden cessation of a twin flame association and attaining closure. Challenges of long distance twin flame overcoming impediments in a long distance twin flame relationship and electing to move on. Divergent life objectives. Navigating twin flame partings prompted by incongruent life trajectories or objectives. Recovery from toxic twin flame bond. Recuperating from a twin flame liaison that devolved into toxicity or detriment. Twin flame and another relationship. Coping with the anguish of a twin flame being involved with another individual. Self-exploration post twin flame. Commencing a voyage of self-exploration and personal development after a twin flame ordeal. Specific circumstances. Adolescent love twin flame separation. Confronting the distinctive trials and teachings of detaching from a twin flame relationship in one's youth. Twin flame matrimony and divorce. Maneuvering through the intricacies of marrying and divorcing a twin flame. Career versus twin flame romance. Choosing between a career prospect and a twin flame liaison. Reunion with twin flame after years. Navigating the emotional expedition of reconnecting with a twin flame after years of separation and charting the course forward. Seven steps to healing and growth. Embracing reality. Acknowledging the truth of twin flame connections. The first step towards healing from a twin flame relationship is acceptance. It entails facing the reality of the situation, whether it involves separation, realizing a false twin flame, or unrequited love. Acceptance doesn't imply approval of the circumstances, rather, it signifies recognizing them as integral parts of your journey. 
This acknowledgement is crucial for healing, allowing for the healthy processing of emotions. In the realm of twin flame journeys, acceptance can pose a considerable challenge due to the profound emotional and spiritual bonds at play. Nonetheless, it stands as an essential stride towards reclaiming agency over your emotions and life. Prioritizing self-care. Nurturing your well-being. Self-care extends beyond mere indulgence, it encompasses actions aimed at safeguarding your physical, emotional, and mental health. In the context of moving on from a twin flame relationship, Self-care assumes paramount importance. This may involve establishing routines, engaging in activities that bring joy, or simply affording yourself the space to mourn and recuperate. It entails deliberate choices that foster well-being, aiding in the restoration of resilience and clarity. Remember, self-care isn't selfish, it's indispensable for the healing process. Seeking support. Harnessing the power of community and professional assistance. Seeking support, whether from loved ones, support networks, or professionals constitutes a crucial facet of the healing journey. It's imperative to recognize that you're not navigating this path alone. Sharing your experiences with empathetic individuals or seeking guidance from experts can offer solace, fresh perspectives, and effective coping mechanisms, particularly in the emotionally intricate landscape of moving on from a twin flame, having a support system can wield significant influence. Embracing change, liberating yourself from attachments, letting go stands as one of the most arduous aspects of transitioning from a twin flame connection. It entails relinquishing emotional ties and preconceived notions. This doesn't equate to erasing memories or dismissing the significance of the individual, rather, it involves forging ahead without allowing them to define your existence. Letting go unfolds as a gradual process of comprehending that certain bonds are not destined to endure, and that your self-worth and happiness aren't contingent upon another's presence. Inner Exploration Navigating the path of self-discovery and healing. Inner exploration encompasses the pursuit of personal growth endeavors that foster self-awareness, healing from past wounds, and overall development. Within the context of a twin flame relationship, this may encompass introspection on lessons gleaned, unraveling relationship patterns, and addressing lingering unresolved issues. It entails redirecting focus inward, nurturing personal evolution and recuperation, forgiveness, releasing resentment and pain. In the context of moving on from a twin flame, forgiveness extends beyond absolving the other person, it encompasses forgiving oneself as well. It entails relinquishing feelings of anger and bitterness and assigning blame. Forgiveness serves as a powerful catalyst for liberation and stands as a pivotal stage in the healing process. Forgiveness doesn't imply condoning past events, rather, it involves consciously choosing to release their emotional grip, openness to fresh bonds, welcoming future opportunities. Remaining receptive to new connections entails allowing oneself to embrace potential relationships and experiences beyond the realm of a twin flame. It's about refraining from closing off avenues to love and companionship with others. This doesn't necessitate rushing into new relationships, but rather fostering an openness to the notion that while the twin flame encounter was significant, it doesn't singularly define one's prospects for profound connections. Why the relationship didn't thrive, unrequited affection. Unreciprocated feelings often serve as a primary obstacle to the success of twin flame relationships. This imbalance can inflict considerable emotional anguish and frequently signifies the unsustainability of the bond. Toxic or destructive dynamics, chaser and runner. Toxic behaviors, exemplified by the chase and retreat dynamic, prove detrimental to both parties involved. Such patterns hinder personal development and culminate in an unhealthy, lopsided relationship. Stifled personal development, a twin flame bond that inhibits personal growth, can be more detrimental than beneficial. Relationships should serve as catalysts for growth, not impediments. Preserving self-esteem. 
Preserving one's self-esteem holds paramount importance. Remaining in a relationship that diminishes one's self-worth is never justifiable, irrespective of the intensity of the connection. Pursuing healthier bonds, striving for healthier relationships serves as a pivotal motive to move on from a twin flame association that no longer serves one's well-being. It entails seeking connections that are nurturing and equitable. Embracing independence. Embracing independence post twin flame entails rediscovering individuality and strengths. It involves deriving satisfaction and fulfillment from solitude while exuding confidence in one's capabilities and choices. Attaining closure. Achieving closure proves indispensable in the journey of moving on from a twin flame. It necessitates coming to terms with the conclusion of the relationship and attaining inner tranquility. Closure empowers individuals to look ahead and focus on fresh beginnings. Reconstructing self-identity. Rebuilding self-identity post-twin flame involves rediscovering one's essence beyond the confines of the relationship. It encompasses a process of self-exploration and reaffirmation of values, beliefs, and interests. Navigating emotional triggers. Navigating emotional triggers entails recognizing and managing emotions and memories that may evoke pain or discomfort. This practice serves as a pivotal aspect of healing, safeguarding against setbacks and emotional well-being, establishing boundaries. Establishing boundaries is fundamental for emotional well-being, particularly after a twin flame parting. It entails delineating what is acceptable and conducive to one's well-being in relationships and life at large. Healing through creative expression. Utilizing creative expression as a means of healing facilitates the constructive processing of emotions. Whether through art, writing, music, or any other medium, creative expression serves as a potent tool in the healing journey. Exploring new life trajectories. Exploring new life paths post twin flame entails embracing novel opportunities and directions. It involves embracing change and the myriad possibilities it entails. Reflecting on the decision to move on from a twin flame. Pondering the rationale behind moving on from a twin flame fosters invaluable introspection and closure. Whether prompted by unreciprocated affection, toxic dynamics, or the pursuit of personal growth comprehending these reasons constitutes an integral facet of the healing process. Actionable steps. Readers can undertake several actionable steps derived from this discourse. Firstly, they can prioritize self-care and cultivate independence. Secondly, engaging in inner exploration and seeking support when necessary proves instrumental. Finally, remaining open to fresh connections and experiences underscores the notion that life post twin flame holds the potential for fulfillment and enrichment. Conclusion. In summation, the journey of moving on from a twin flame encompasses a multifaceted process involving acceptance, self-care, relinquishing attachments, and personal development. Each step, from seeking support to embracing new connections, plays a pivotal role in fostering healing and progression.